Another big industry will reopen tomorrow in Texas. Bars are itching to welcome customers in. Fox 44's Cameron Stewart, he talked to a few local watering holes, frantically getting ready after a few months away. Hey, Cameron. Hey, Adam. For Texans, happy hours officially back tomorrow. For the bar owners, they hope this turns into a string of happy days, and they're expecting it to start with a bang. We're ready. We're ready for all of you guys to come out. Bar owners heard the announcement from Governor Greg Abbott Monday that they could finally reopen after more than two months. While it came with excitement, there was a lot of work to be done. It's a big cleaning process this week, so lots of sanitizing, power washing, uh, even the dog's going to get a bath here pretty soon, so <laughs> we're excited about that. It's been a whirlwind because our whole setup has to change. You go up to a counter and order your food most of the time, and now you'll have a server, which is totally different for us. So it's been a learning curve all week long. Even though restaurants were able to reopen three weeks ago, bars were not afforded the same luxury. Not being able to open back up as a bar after the restaurants opened was kind of deflating. And what made it deflating was there was no reason why, uh, because we can set up just like a restaurant did. So it, it was a little frustrating for a few weeks watching uh, everybody else get into the swing of it, and we could. Some bars, like the Dancing Bear Pub, are only opening up their patios to help distance customers more easily. For places like Freight Bar in Waco, the space they already have makes it a lot easier to make this socially distanced transition. We've always socially distanced here um, with our, our large yard, and um, so, so we're very excited to have a place that everybody can be here, um, be with your group, be safe, but also be with a whole lot of other people. The owners are expecting a stampede of customers this weekend, and the familiar faces are what they have missed the most. I miss people. <laughs> it's going to be tough for me because I'm going to have my face mask on. And, uh, but uh, hopefully I'll still get to talk to a lot of people. And um, that's why I wanted to open this place is, is to be with, with other great people from Central Texas. Even with certain restrictions, both the backyard and freight bars are planning to stick to their regular concert schedule starting this Saturday. Live in the studio, I'm Cameron Stewart, Fox 44 News.